What qualified repeatable metal additive manufacturing processes allow you to do is to send a part digitally to anywhere in the world, create the part at the point of need, qualify the part, and put it on the system. Open Additive is a small business here in Beaver Creek, Ohio. We're focused on metal additive manufacturing systems, sensors, and applications development. This is our Open Additive Panda metal 3D printing system. It's a laser powder bed fusion platform with integrated sensing and analytics for making parts of all kinds of varieties. Open Additive's product line is focused on laser powder bed fusion, which is a metal additive manufacturing process that uses a laser to selectively melt powders in a layer-by-layer -layer process to build up a three-dimensional part. We actually are working on a project right now for the Air Force Life Cycle Management Command to put a system in a containerized structure that can be shipped worldwide and used at points of need. The advantage of Open Additive is that our systems are adaptable for customer-specific needs. The machine control software itself gives the end user a number of different ways that they can control how they want to build their parts without having to involve us as the originators of the system. Our Panda platform options are currently 6, 11, and 24 inches. The 24 inches is still under development. And we actually started originally with the 6-inch platform and then expanded it to the 11-inch platform. Our technical point of contact is Adam Hicks over at the Air Force Research Lab. His domain expertise in additive means that when we discuss the development of the large format multi-laser machine that we're developing, his questions are very deep and help drive us to create an even better test bed to meet their needs. We really need to get more of a basic understanding of these multi-laser systems in order to facilitate transition into the Air Force platforms. The real driver for the need for the open architecture systems that Open Additive provides is to open up that black box that exists within other additive manufacturing providers. We want to increase our readiness of our fleet. We want to decrease the downtime in the depots. We don't want a plane sitting on the ground because we're missing one casting and it takes six months to get that casting and we can't do anything without it. We want to eliminate those choke points in the supply chain. We also want to enable future Air Force platforms to really benefit from everything additive manufacturing has to offer. Lightweight, complex geometries, high functionalization. The SBIR program I think is important for our organization specifically because it allows us to interface with small businesses and get our hands on technologies early on, make them start thinking about manufacturing. It also allows us to see up and coming manufacturing technologies to help influence where our dollars go, making the best investment for the Air Force. Open Additive is really proud to be a US based manufacturer of laser powder bed platforms, sensing and analytics, and other technologies for the Department of Defense. Our legacy as Open Additive stems from a defense services firm which has been supporting the warfighter since 1961. Now as an independent company, we're really proud to continue to support the Air Force and other Department of Defense agencies to provide metal added manufacturing solutions to real problems.